Hello, 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 beautiful developers and amazing coders. How are you this lovely day? If you're new to my channel, my name is Elifteria and I'm a front-end developer currently working in the daily UI challenge and I'm doing the daily UI challenge usually uh, with AngularJS and Material UI but today we have a twist. I think it's the first time that I'm going to be doing that for this challenge that I'm going to be using Bootstrap. Yep, you heard that right. I'm not going to be using that much the material UI framework, but I'm going to be using Bootstrap. And for day 72, because yeah, we are finally on day 72, we have an image slider and I'm not going to combine this theme with anything else. It's going to be purely an image slider. It's going to be something single yet cool that you can use it like wherever you may like. So for today's theme we have the image slider and the working area we are going to write everything and in the script I have my angular.js as well as the bootstrap UI. In the CSS I don't have anything special just a body with this background and then a theme and the working area. In the JavaScript part, I have just my Angular module up and this time I'm having as a dependency the Bootstrap UI. Inside there I'm going to have a function with the Carousel demo controller and we're going to write everything in a bit for the Carousel demo controller. Alright, uh, before we start coding, let me please remind you to hit that subscribe button, that would be awesome and it would make my day. And of course, in the description box you will find all the information that you may need, like the links to my code pen or the links to GitHub if you don't um, use like code pen, um, as well as other links that I'm going to be using to create this project. All right, let's start. I will start from the working area and in my first div, I'm going to add an ID. I'm going to name this ID like a uh, slides control and inside there, I'm going to have my carousel. Carousel, okay. So yeah, the, basically the idea is of creating a carousel for the um, image slider. Now inside the carousel, I'm going to have the interval equals, okay, let's copy that, my interval. We're going to add this interval in the JavaScript in a bit. And inside the carousel, I will need the slide. Okay, let me also close the slide. And the first thing that I need inside here is an ng repeat with slide in slides. Of course, we will write also these things into the JavaScript. And last but not least, I'm going to need an active equals active dot not like slide dot active okay and now right here i'm going to need the images so for the image i'm going to have like an img and gc oops c or s uh with the slide and then image so slide door image as simple as that of course, I have to type correctly. Cool. And do I need anything else? Maybe I can all also add like a div like this. And this div is going to have another class. I will name this class maybe carousel, carousel and caption. Okay. And inside here, I'm going to have an H4 or header 4. Okay, so we will also have a caption for its image. It's going to be a slide, and then it will be like a dollar and index plus one. We need the plus one because we're starting from zero. 
and now I have h4, div and slide and carry result. So we've closed everything. So let's go to the JavaScript to add all the scopes and things like that. The first one is going to be like scope dot interval, and here you will add some milliseconds. So I'm going to have it as oops. Um, I'm going to have it as a scope interval equals three seconds or like 300 milliseconds. Okay, and now the other and maybe most important thing that I want is to have my slides. Okay, like that. No. Okay. Um, I will add a couple of images and in order to do so I'm going to have like an image then a URL here and that's basically it. I have already found the images that I want to use and for the images I used the Unsplash and I'm on the category of people. I really, really like using Unsplash. I mentioned it on my previous project and yeah, like I will leave in the description box the link for Unsplash. So really quickly I'm going to add my images. Okay, and yeah, pretty much we're getting closer. Now we will need another thing in the CSS, uh, I have to add some classes. So after the working area, I'm going to the slides, control, okay. And here I'm going to add a position of absolute, okay. And a width, nope, width like that 460 pixels which is also the pixels that i'm using here for the working area and left is going to be 50 percent and top is going to be like 90 pixels and then or also a margin left with minus 230 pixels uh this margin is like half of the width and that's how we do it okay but uh let's see what we are missing i'm going to save it oops and we had made a mistake and the image of course i have to spell it correct in order to to have something so that's it guys um you have slide one through four and this is due to um, our function carousel with the four images here and you can also see these buttons right here so you can click back and forth and that was our project i really hope that you liked it and if you did then please don't forget to like share and subscribe um also if you have any question or something just leave a comment below and i will do my best to answer it thank you very much have an amazing day and see you really soon